So the question is that the question quiz said should I learn programming or not because I'm in Syria? Should I learn programming or not because I'm in Syria? Oh Syria, oh Syria, the world power I mean. Ah my heart really cry, I mean. I'm a Muslim, a lot of people do not think what Muslim mean and what Islam mean. I mean the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said even even the dictator is a tyrant. Even he is an evil dictator. Even he is, he is an evil secular dictator. You can't rebel against him. You can't rebel against him. The Prophet of Islam said you can't fight against him. Why? It will cause mis uh, mischief on the land if you don't know what mischief means mischief mean it will cause i mean bloodshed on the land mischief but some muslim think that they need to fight uncle sam giving them money i mean they are mercenary the people who are taking their wages and fighting some kind of bogus war in the name of god they are mercenary they are not fighting for their religion they are not fighting for muslim they are killing muslim more than 300,000 muslim had died to syrian war back in iraq saddam hussein was an evil dictator but he was a secular dictator syria secular dictator libya secular dictator so so the world power want to bring the Islamic dictator at the same time they think Islam is evil. I really don't want to continue with my rant because I'm going to start crying. I mean it's enough with Islam. I mean Muslim have become sandwich in the world to be honest with you. Oh God bless us please. I mean I had faced a lot of discrimination due to whatever happening in Middle East. Killing is prohibited in Islam. But Muslims are killing Muslims. Same people who read the same name of the word are killing each other. Who gave you authority to do that? But the prophecies. If you are Muslim, if you are not a Muslim, you will read the prophecy of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. He said, at the end of the time, in Iraq there will be a lot of bloodshed. Muslim will be killing Muslim. Again, that there that is a prophecy, and then Roman, Roman, Roman. Again, I'm saying, Roman will come to help, and Roman will be victorious, and Muslim is celebrated. A lot of people are going to argue with me. Who is Roman? Only the people who are a bit sent know that Roman are Russian or Roman Empire is to the Russian Empire. I mean, I don't want to go into detail. I mean, anyways. I'm not agreeing with Russia. I don't like Russia, but at this point, they are doing something which is making sense, at least showing some progress. Anyways, if any of the Muslim is seeing this in my video, please, please, please love each other. I mean, if you love each other, respect each other. Today, women, my sister, my mother in Syria have no home. They had become refugees, staying at ref refugee camps. Due to who? It was much better they live under an evil dictator rather than living under a refugee camp. There's no justification. There's no justification to fight a evil dictator to throw his regime just to cause a mischief on the land, kill unlimited amount of people just to throw up one evil dictator you want to kill one evil dictator you had destroy all the society now back to your question i will say that to you my brother look into nano degree currently nano degrees offering i mean scholarship from for for the student for the people who are from syria at the end of the day today syria is like this or uh, maybe tomorrow Syria will be much better place. Maybe tomorrow I will come to visit Syria. 
to be honest with you today syria is in pain due to who i i i be born you know i mean who is funding i mean rebel groups who is giving their weapon i mean everyone know i mean who is trying to create a bogus i mean holy war there bogus holy war but today syria is in pain tomorrow syria will not be in pain tomorrow syria will be much better so you need to keep moving on until you die learn 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 until you die this life is a test whenever you're taking the test you don't know what you need to, for example i'm talking about the real paper test you're taking like a mathematics test you don't know the answer you are frustrated so are you going to i mean tear of the page in frustration which is equal to suicide or doing nothing wait until that approach you are you going to tear off the exam paper or your test paper and then wait until that that approach you or you are being killed for no reason or you learn something you learn something you teach someone and that he learn something and he teach someone maybe there can be a university or institute to come from it you can co found something you can co found a comp if you don't know read the history a lot of companies are founded during the war the famous brand today we know i mean i mean nokia nokia not founded in during world war 2 but they gained a lot of popularity success during the war read the stories of the company which were founded during the war if you still not motivated then you need to find some reason you need to be learning programming for your loved one firstly do not ask me a questions of such like they should i learn programming or not because i'm in syria it doesn't matter wherever you are my brother it doesn't really matter wherever you are learn programming if you know the stuff i mean whatever devices you have even a netbook is more sufficient enough for your program learn and build some portfolio and then try to i mean i mean build portfolio more and more and then get some client even you can get some kind of job or you can move into another muslim country do not try to become a migrant just try to become a refugee in a muslim country maybe you can come into pakistan days is a lot of demand for web developer or programmer i mean go to pakistan much better my personal opinion is that keep on learning learn until you die no one can stop you unless if you have decided that you want to wait until that approach you today is the hard day tomorrow will not be the hard day whatever the syrian government can provide you the resources they can provide you of learning mean if i mean if you can get enrolled in the government university currently of say even as a associate degree do it do whatever the syrian government is providing you take at and appreciate it and they thank syrian government a lot of i'm going to get hate because i know the reality how the world work and for your information i'm a muslim i'm a sunni muslim so plus i follow my religion very strictly i pray five times a day i keep my beard that is a muslim muslim is not killing innocent people trying to throw a dictator with no justification i will happily live under a evil dictator if he let me pray i will happily live under a evil dictator if he let me pray i really do not care about a democ- democracy or a dictatorship i just want peace this was a quite long rant video whoever watching mean syria or in a war torn country in somalia or wherever my brothers keep on learning never stop learning god is great god is great never stop learning we need to make this world a better place please god is great god is great you need to keep moving on do you forget the golden age of islam where we developed the first photographic camera where ibn fana developed the first flight an aeroplane where we developed the first medicine where we developed the first injection where we developed the first first atlas I mean we did a lot of stuff where we developed the algebra mathematic number arabic number so my all my muslim brother and sister if you're watching this video take an all to yourself 
you need to learn something you need to provide the learning the knowledge to someone else and then you need to build something i really want muslim to become inventor muslim to become coder so they can divert the intention from whatever happening there to the good side to the positive side keep learning hard try to be friendly if someone discriminate you just try to smile at them you will face racism if you go to a foreign country you will face it i can understand why you will face it due to the wrong image but as our job we need to crack our image the way we can crack is with love smile we are made to be love without love we are empty love is everything so keep on loving each other keep on learning keep on helping each other live in harmony my friend my brother my sister live in harmony i really want you to become a successful software engineer developer whatever you want to be one day i will meet you i'm 100% sure but by then i really want you to become a successful and then you will be saying jimmy see I was in Syria. The time was hard, but now Syria has been stable. The economy is growing. Now I'm earning six-figure income. Or I have a car. I just get married. I really want to hear that kind of story. It's me, Jimmy Geek. Subscribe to my channel. Email me at jimmygeek at gmail dot com. Bye.